and welcome to another episode of Up Close. I am Toby G, and uh, today we have Tandi Ngoana. Tandi, uh, you are part of our, our Rose University Community Engagement Division. Can you uh, tell us a little bit about uh, you and also what you are doing at um, Rose University Community Engagement Division? Hi, Toby. Thank you so much for inviting me in the show. I am a community engagement lecturer at Rhodes University and also the program coordinator for the Wollingela program. Um, I started in this post at the beginning of 2019, which was last year, um, where I took over the high school side of parental support. Um, the high school side meaning parents who have kids in grade 10s to grade 12. So I've just been running that program so far. Awesome. Uh, Tandi, you mentioned uh, the parent program. Uh, that is that is Woodin Jenner, right? Um, so yes, the Bullying Jela is a parent engagement program. We actually um, renamed the program last year, at the end of last year, when we realized that the parent engagement program actually had two divisions. One division being the high school division and then the other being the in-zone program. So right now we have the parent involvement and parent involvement includes um, Bullying Jela, which is the high school program as well as the insomni reading program so the volunteer program is a parent involvement program which was started as part of the vice chancellor's initiative um, so parental involvement in students academic achievement has been an ongoing topic of discussion and research in education, whether attending school functions or meetings, assisting with homework, volunteering in the school or communicating with teachers. Parents' involvement has produced positive impacts in many areas of students' lives. So um, this is one of Volintela's aims with the objective of working with Rhodes University staff members who are in the grades or pay grades of grades one to grade five. We will try to improve their children's access to higher education by working with these staff members. Um, how we recruit these staff members is that we send out a call at the end of each year on top list, which is the Rhodes University um, staff email, um, to inform staff members about the program and how to join. We also print out recruitment posters for staff members, which we put out around campus so that they can read on how to join the program. We also work with the Office of Nehawu, which is a staff union, and this staff union basically helps us at their office to recruit some staff members if they haven't seen the email. We also have student volunteers who work with us as tutors and mentors for grades 10 to grades 12. These tutors joined the Volunteer program through the Engage Reading program, which is run by Tobani. And these tutors, they undergo a training at the beginning of the year. Um, and this training basically helps them to better equip um, them in, in, in their respective tutoring subjects. Then when the tutor, when the tasks get going, the tutors are able to uh, manage their, their classes. Tandi, you also mentioned over there that um, staff also, um, they give a helping hand. Um, I just want to go back to what you mentioned over there. Um, has there been a positive outcome to Vulin Zela ever since it started? Um, yes. Toby, actually, last year we had some nice results for grade 12s. Um, we, we, we had some of our kids basically being able to register for their first year at university. We have one learner who has actually registered for a diploma course um, at NMU. And yeah, we, we've, we've had a, a positive year um, last year. We also, if I remember correctly, have one learner who is also registered at Gadra um, and will be improving his results so that he can then join us at Rhodes University next year. 
sounds wonderful absolutely wonderful um, again tandy um with Vulinzela, a person that is listening right now and is saying look i'm really interested in this initiative what is currently being done by Vulinzela, and i really want to find out a bit more how can a person be part of uh of Vulinzela? We do recruiting via the various channels, including the Nehal offices. We, at the end of the year, we normally post our posters all around campus. But um, if a person hasn't seen this recruitment, then they can come to the office, um, ask for me, Tandy, and then um, I'll take them through the process. But um, that's basically how we... Um, how a person can actually join us. But if the, the, the certain individual is the student and they'd like to tutor some of the staff members' kids, um, let's say the person is a math tutor. So what they can do is that they can come to the office um, right at the beginning of the year and um, they'll be able to join the ECP program. And under the ECP program, we have different divisions. So for example, we have Mind Hands, Body Q, um, and also Vulinjela. So they can they can choose to be a tutor for Vulinjela, mm. um, of which they will undergo training on one Saturday at the beginning of the year, um, which falls on to a, a Sunday also. After they've done the tutor training, then they become part of the Vulinjela family. Um, we meet on Saturdays, we offer tutoring to the kids, um, and we just have fun around, around sharing some of the challenges that the kids are having. Um, in their respective subjects. So a person can join using those platforms. If someone wants to get hold of us on Facebook, they can go to the Rhodes University Community Engagement Facebook page where they'll see some posts on what um, we're currently doing during the lockdown. Um, or if they, they can't access Facebook, then they can always email us and we can take them through the um, Rhodes University Community Engagement website. Um, my email address is t.mawana at g at rd.ac.za, sorry. <laughs> Thanks, Toby. All right, cool stuff. Thank you very much, uh, Tandi, for coming in and just really sharing about Vodin Zela and also how can a person get involved. Really do appreciate you having uh, to drop by, really. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Toby. So there you have it. That was Tandi Moana uh, with Wudin Lela telling us a little bit about Wudin Lela and how can a person get involved. Uh, from our side, Toby G, I'm out. This was uh, Up Close uh, Podcast.